What's up, y'all? I got a family defeat, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into Phantom um, addressing his health problems. Let's get it. From the top, I want to give y'all this update real quick. I want to give y'all this update. Um, and I don't want to, like, you know what I'm saying? Keep dragging sh or keep talking about it after I um explain real quick what's going on. Damn, that. son. You know what I'm saying? So, look. Happy um, him explaining that he already seemed like he out of breath. Am, am I tripping? Um, y'all oh, can't even <clears> see him. <throat> hold on, hold on. Why are he acting like he had a breath like that? Because maybe he is. Uh, We're going to start from the top. I want to give you this update real quick. I want to give you this update. Um, and I don't want to like, you know what I'm saying? Keep dragging or keep talking about it after I um explain real quick what's going yeah, on. Your bro is out of breath. You know what I'm saying? So look, um, y'all know, <clears throat> know I'll be catching like a lot of flights and like, just like to go shoot recordings and stuff like that and a whole bunch of sh um and for those you don't know if you follow me either on snap or ig i do be posting a lot you know what i'm saying like oh i'm going here i'm going there you know what i'm saying and stuff like that um for those of you who know i've been on a sick streak i've never been on this streak so long like it's insane i've been on a sick streak i feel like i feel like ever since like the first time i got like crazy kind of sick like somewhat like it wasn't normal to me was when we went to nigeria shot to all my nigerians in a Chat Ray E in the chat talking shit, Ray E. Um, when he was in Nigeria and and the lady fucked me up. And then ever since then, to that point, I hit the pollen season and that fucked me up. You know what I'm saying? And then I went to the UK and I didn't know they hay fever, which is pollen, pretty much the same. Is even worse than the US and that was and that fucked me up. Mm. Um, and then like I got like I couldn't hear out my ear for like five days and mm. I had to like depressurize this shit, congested and a whole bunch of bull. And I get back to the U.S. and I'm still calm for like three days, and then I flew. yeah, I ain't gonna lie, them sinuses will kill you. Flew from New York to ATL every day for like six days straight, low key. And all that flight, I guess I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I'm just giving you the, the context behind everything before we really get into it. Um, cause I have flew back for something that I can't talk about to ATL, then came back to New York, then did something here in NYC downtown. Which I can't talk about that either, but y'all see it soon. No BW. Uh, and then I left that same day uh, to go do. Um, KC told me to come through for Kevin Hart, the Drewski stream. Uh, uh, ben was on there, Duke. You know what I'm saying? That was a W stream. That was a W stream. Was no cap. That was W stream. You know what I'm saying? So we flew over there, right? We flew over there. We did that, and then I had came back, um, and I was moving shit around. Then my boy, www facts. Now everything. Sitchy, I ain't gonna lie, but let's let's get into it. Um, and then I got I want to go get tatted. You know what I'm saying? I had an like, appointment I've been had for like two, three months. Now, this way it get kind of heavy, chat. I ain't gonna lie, sorry, it get kind of crazy. So my session was gonna be like a three, four day session, and I decided to like they told me like yo, you can go under and you go like take anesthesia and you go under for like I don't know how long it is. I think it's like eight hours or some shit, and you finish it all and it's like a normal thing, niggas be doing that shit. For a tattoo or for tattoos? Boom. So I'm like, ah, you bet. That's calm. I did it. Nothing was crazy. You feel me? In my opinion, I think everything was smooth. I wake up. I get my shit done. Y'all going to see as soon as on my chest and shit. You know, I got a lot of tats. I don't really show my tats, but my whole back is tatted. Um, here, all this, and then here now, too. Um, long story short, um, I wake up normal. Everything, I think, is fine. Um, this girl keep and this I mean, it's eight hours, chat. So I'm hungry as fuck, and I'm starving. I ain't gonna lie, chat. Um, uh -huh. And yeah, this is where, like, now we could really slow down the story and really, because mm. this is I don't want to. You know, once again, I don't want to. This is not like a something for me to extend or make it make it bigger than what it is. You know what I'm saying? It, it was. It's a very serious thing, but I didn't want to. Like that was never my intentions. I know, like the tweet. I had made a tweet, and it was crazy because the tweet was specifically for the truth. It just happened to hit like. Major blogs and shit like that. And shout out to y'all. But that's why I put in the tweet 10 hour stream tomorrow. So shout out, you know what I'm saying? It, whatever. Point is, I, shit. I wake up and I'm a little dazed, of course. You know what I'm saying? Um, I've been under anesthesia before when I did my uh, my wisdom teeth or whatever. I, there's nothing crazy. I go to the crib. When I go to the crib chat, for some reason, I decide to order four burgers. <laughs> I don't know what possessed me to order four fucking burgers, bro, but I did. 
Then I ordered two big ass fucking fries, chat, like the hugest shit ever. Like this some big ass shit, gang. Then I get two extra large lemonades. I'm wilding, chat. Yo, what? Am I what? Doing? The fuck? Nah, he tripping. Fuck out, chat. You know what I'm saying? Four burgers, two large fries. No. Hell no. <laughs> And, and like I'm mad hungry and it's funny but it's not funny but it's funny I ain't gonna lie it's funny but it's not funny but it's funny like and I knock down my two burgers mad fast I leave two for later I knock down the fries and I go 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 with the lemonade stop the tunes stop the tunes I, I like knock it down and like the world like record time it had to be like six minutes tops oh no. I was so hungry I was starving chat um and, and I know I'm wild I'm wild I'm wild but it's true though and I didn't even let my body, like, digest the food. Like, oh, no. I didn't even let my body digest the fucking food, bro. So I go, and I did some dickhead shit, and I went straight to bed. I went straight, I went late. Wow. Oh, he was trying, oh, okay. Okay, he was trying to get up out of here. Right, quick. <laughs> lay down. Whoop, lay down, right, chat? Nah. I laid down, and... It's like 11 p.m. now, right? I'm trying to um, I'm trying to sleep, and I keep waking up every two hours. And like, I keep getting like, um, what's heart that palpitation, called? like acid, keep mm, coming up, bro. acid. Mm. And I'm like, nigga, like, what the fuck? Like, it keep like, I'm like, bro, and it's like pissing me off. And like, I keep like, it's like uncomfortable. My That's uncomfortable chat. right now. Whatever you eating right now was bad. And I keep waking up every two hours to go back to sleep. I go every two hours to go back to sleep. You know what I'm saying? And then I I, I think I had a long streak from like 5 a.m. to not to 8 30 a.m. around there. While I was able to sleep like three hours. Then I wake up and I think I'm fine. I think everything's good, right, chat? Don't feel somebody said that the food was fighting back. Yo, be nature. Brother Nature, appreciate the gift these game. So, anyways, long story short, bro. Uh huh. Now it's like 8, 9 30 in the morning. I get some oatmeal, chat. Bananas. Like, this is probably the healthiest meal I had the whole week, gang. Eh? It's like, this is this is like, this is is like what made me laugh, like, at myself. Like, I take a bite of the oatmeal, chat, Threw up. and it felt like an elephant came and just sat on my chest. <laughs> out of nowhere. I'm like, what the fuck, bro? Then, after that, it was like a nigga grab. It felt like somebody grabbed my heart trying to pull it out. I'm mm. like, word to my mother, chat. And I'm thinking like, okay, that's one, two, three times, four times, five times, six times. I'm panicking now. I ain't gonna lie. I'm in the apartment by myself. No, like nobody was with me. I'm by myself, and I'm I'm panicking. Like no funny shit. Like real shit though. I'm doing this though, like, like, all jokes aside, like, let's, let's get into serious mode. Let's really lock in. No, seriously, you had a heart attack. He had a heart attack. He don't even know he had a heart attack. You had one. My cousin just had a heart attack not too long ago. He experienced the same shit. But he called the ambulance. And for those that don't know, especially since we all kind of going through this, aspirin can subside a heart attack. It's not going to stop it. But it subsides it. Sometimes you got to get a balloon in there. Um, it's a lot going on. Okay. But acid can subside it at least until the um, ambulance come. Quick chat. Serious The ambulance going to get you uh, aspirin too if uh, you didn't have aspirin. Like no more funny joking shit. Like, like that'll stop you from dying right then and there. If that makes any sense. For some people. Not for everybody. It can stop you from dying. That ass. Like. 35, almost 40 minutes of me doing this, gang. And I'm like, you know, I'm a... 35, I'm like, 40 minutes, so he sat through the heart attack? Oh, my God. And people wondering why we saying rest in peace to people today. Like, randomly, like, yo, that nigga was just good. No, niggas is having heart attacks and all kind of fucked up shit around this bitch. Lord have mercy. Like one of them niggas that I find humor in everything. I'm really thinking like this is crazy. I survived the Bronx. I survived my childhood. I survived a heart like, attack. Random bullets. This is how I go out. 
this is how I, this is this is this is how I die. Like I'm over here like laughing, but it's it's I'm in mad pain though. And I grab my phone and like I'm from like I don't know what it is, bro. I don't know if it's the way we 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 like was raised and shit. But like I, I don't like hospitals, gang. I'm gonna keep it above. I don't like hospitals, bro. But I'm about to call 911 and open my door and put the little um the lock on it. So if I do pass out in the crib, it's just easy access to me. You feel me? So I'm like, you know, I'm just trying to wait it out, bro. I'm being a dickhead, a toxic, what's that shit called? Toxic masculinity, whatever the fuck that shit's called. I'm being stupid. Like, I should have been went to the spittle right there. And I didn't. I'm just waiting, like, just trying to... Trying nah, to, like, actually, no, you should have called the ambulance. Granted, you sitting there for 40 minutes is crazy. Should have called the ambulance after that third, that that third pool, but... Trying to, like, hold it out, like, like hopefully the pain leave. Because it felt like a... A long heartburn. It just felt like a long ass heartburn. The pain was ten out of ten. It was a heart attack. So, anyways, it finally passes through. My dumb ass gets on WebMD. This is where like shit start going left. I get on WebMD. Now I'm on WebMD, and everything I search up, you have a it. heart attack. I got that shit. I got that. I got that shit too. I'm googling shit, nigga. So I'm writing in what I feel, and everything I see, I'm like, I got that. I might got, I think I got this too. I'm panicked. I'm like, like, it's like, I'm fucking up my own head, bro. So I'm like, damn, bro. Like, and I'm by myself. I'm not calling nobody like a dickhead. So, you know, like two, three Man. hours pass. I start calming down, calming down. Um, but it, I, the pain is still there in my chest. It's, it's, it's a heavy pain. It's not when, like, it's not 10 out of 10, like when it was happening for those 40 minutes. But it's more like a five out of 10 now. Like, not nah, like a six out of 10. So it's like it's there, like it's like there, you know? So anyway, fast forward some more chat. Um the next day comes and I start noticing that I'm like delirious. Like is that the word? Like I'm like I got the days messed up and shit. Like I think it's Thursday, but it's Wednesday, like I'm fucked up. I gotta go to Cali. I gotta go do some shit. Um I had a big opportunity that I had to miss out. Six figure bag, chat, oh, no cat. No. Six figure bag. I had to like, I had to really catch myself and say, gang, you almost, yo, W Gifty, um, shout to, shout to Tariq, 22, all right, gang, gang. So, like, I'm thinking, like, you got to, Phantom, you got to fake slow down a little bit because you moving too much now. Like, you almost, we don't know what happened Damn, in, that, right? in that apartment when you was by yourself because I'm, I'm, I'm not a doctor. I really here. can't diagnose myself. But I'm like, you got to catch this flight, you know what I'm saying? Honey buns, you know what I'm saying? Like, six-figure up shit. You got to catch that flight, gang. And in that moment, I'm like, yo, bro, like, I, you can't, it don't matter if, they, if, if niggas would have threw me a billion dollars, gang. If you die, you can't put the money to use at all. Facts. So you can't get on that flight, gang. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, all right, let me slow down for a little bit. Let me slow down for a little bit. Because at the end of the day, you need to chill. So I, I grabbed myself. I, I kind of like had to, I, I hated that. I had to like say I can't, I can't come through. And it, now it has been two days. You know what I'm saying? And then yesterday, yesterday being the third day. Ryan, um, what happened? Shit calm. I wake up. You know what I'm saying? I'm, uh, I'm feeling better. I'm taking mad tea and soup. I still haven't gone to the spittle. Nothing like that. I think I'm getting better. Um... And I happen to call for blood. I call for blood for some fucking reason. I just, I, my, I just call for blood. So now I'm like, damn, like, I really don't want to go to the hospital, but I should go to the hospital. Hello. If, if anything is pointing me to go to the spittle, this is the time to go. This is like the now, time. Like, now you got to go. So I call for blood and, 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 and I'm like, damn, and like it hurts. Like I'm short of breath. The pain never really left past a five. It's still five out of ten the whole time. You know what I'm saying? And I go to the um, I go to the spittle, bro. Fuck it. I go to the hospital. Fuck it. I don't want to go to the hospital. And I got my reasons for it. And I'm gonna keep it nice and short. But I got a lot of you know homies, friends that passed away. And also people I know go to the hospital. They never leave it, bro. You know what I'm saying? Put two and two together. So I just be having my own superstitions. You know what I'm saying? I believe in science to the max. Shout to all the beautiful doctors out there in the world. I just be panicking about hospitals, bro. So whatever. So I go to the hospital. I say, fuck it. I'm going to the hospital. I go, Cap. He need to get him a doctor on payroll or a nurse. Go to the hospital. They and, come to the crib. And when I get to the hospital, um, 
they um they do scans, they do CT scans, they do some other shit too. They do they do a whole bunch of shit. You know what I'm saying? W hospital, W doctors, um, and they fucking they um they had me. I was there for like not too long, probably like five hours, chat. And at the end, they finally like tell me what it was. Somewhat, they didn't know what the pain, the original pain is from, like you the had a original heart one, the forty minute one. But it's better than what the fuck I thought I had. So at the end of the day, chat. Um, I gotta take some pills for like seven days. Um, antibiotics, niggas is good. You know what I'm saying? Just clap it up for that. You know what I'm saying? Everything's itchy. Um, but um, basically, what I have is I have pneumonia. That's what I got. Pneumonia. And I forgot how I got it, but mm-hmm. something about the acid going up in, in my thingy went through my lungs and cooked me. Huh. You feel me? <laughs> and then, my thingy. It's the I got. You know what I'm saying? I gotta chill, chat. That's crazy. But, it was pneumonia for you too. That's crazy. But besides that, chat. We here, we good money. You know what I'm saying? Pneumonia, yeah, 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 I know, I know it's heavy, but I should be fine. It's just seven days of popping these uh pills, and I and I should be good, chat. And I and you know what I'm saying? And I, and I realized that damn Ryan doing all that shit. You know what I'm saying? I gotta just. I'm glad you're still here, bro. <laughs> health is really wealth, bro. And it's like world of my mother, bro. It's like you can't you can't play with certain shit, bro. You dead ass can't play with certain. You can't. Shortcut shit, you gotta just, you know what I'm saying? So, we're gonna slow it down from now on in certain avenues. And all that mean is, I'm going to the gym soon. So, W Stream on the way with the gyms. Hello. Uh, let's clap it up for that. And let me, they haven't confirmed um, the seat, the scans that they did, by the way, just to give you an update. I haven't got the update yet from them. They said they would call me. So, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't have the, you know what I'm saying? But once again, chat, um, Jump, gym stream on the way, but we not about to do some shit, like, we not doing this gym stream for content, like, it's not a con, like, we really gonna be on our shit, though, like, if I needed a sign, that's what it was right there. Okay. If I needed any sign, that's I what it was right there. Up. I knew something was wrong, I got super skinny, they said my body was eating itself alive. God damn, because of the medicine? Like, no funny shit, bro. I don't need to pop no fucking Ozempic pills, fuck out of here. I just need to do, go to the gym, eat good, you know what I'm saying, and get and get right, bro, and get right, bro. That's all it is, chat. You know what I'm saying? So let's really do it, though. Let's clap it up for everybody who showed me mad love. I would not, I don't want to single out nobody, so I don't want to name him one by one. But it was mad love. People hit me up, um, and mad people hit me up, chat. Like a lot of streamers, like a lot of like creators, a lot of like artists, mad people show me mad love. People give me tips on what to do, like you know what I'm saying, get my get my health in order and shit. You know what I'm saying? And then two. Um, I I, also, I hope we got a trainer. I, I don't think I have to say this real quick, but I'm gonna just say it anyway. I I didn't make that tweet to alert anybody. If you see, I even said like, oh, ten hour stream tomorrow. I'm not even thinking like, it just happened to hit like a different avenue of people and shit. So that's why I were. But listen, once again, love y'all for real, for real. We so locked in. We so locked in. We was already locked in before this shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, we are so locked the fuck in. That's what's up. Um. I mean, not that he going through all that. I, I'm just happy that he um, figured it out. Cause oh my god, I, I still feel like it was a heart attack. Could be wrong, but I'm just glad he's alive. Whew. Y'all, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. That's why I've been telling y'all about acid reflux and all that. And y'all like, damn, Nick, um, you can't eat chicken no more. You can't eat all this. No, and I'm not either. <laughs> I attempted to eat chicken yesterday, and to be honest, it's the chicken that I cooked, and I cook good chicken, but the chicken was nasty to me. I, I didn't like it, and I didn't feel like it was worth me going through that little phase I go through with the chicken. It just kind of makes me feel dizzy, and like I don't put something bad in my system when I swallow Paul's chicken. So um, I do not eat chicken anymore. I actually eat turkey wings if I'm if I'm gonna eat some wings. Um, I use turkey, uh, breast if I want to eat like a wrap or something or like shrimp and that depends on the day with the shrimp. Um, yeah, I eat meat. I will eat beef, uh, bison, bison better than beef, uh, lean wise. And it's just not as harsh. It's still red meat, but it's not as harsh as beef. Um, but I absolutely have to watch what I eat real bad. And I do. 
Um, and I'm way older than him. I'm like 10 years older than him. So, but he was for a while just kind of eating whatever he pleased. Like four burgers, two large fries and two large lemonades. Smash that shit and just go to sleep. Uh, y'all, I, let me tell y'all a story before we get off here. Several months ago, I'm probably lying a year ago. I'm lying. Um, cause my boy just, okay. A year ago, I went to my friend's house and they cooked beef something, maybe beef ribs. I never had beef ribs before. So he, he likes beef. He makes beef bacon, all that, right? So I ate the beef ribs. And normally I had me a good old um, soda water, sparkling water, whatever y'all call it, to wash the shit down. But I didn't have nothing at their house. Um, they don't have it at their house because everybody ain't got to drink sparkling water. So I'm, I smashed the shit. It was so good. Smash the shit, drinking water to take it down. No, strike one. So I'm driving home and it was a long drive, by the way. But it felt like my stomach was about to come through my mouth. Like it felt like it felt like metal was in my stomach. It absolutely was acid, but it felt like metal was in my stomach. I didn't know what it was until after the fact. Um, but anyway, I couldn't lay down because if I would have laid down, something was going to come up out of there. So I had to sit up in the bed and go to sleep. Never felt that in my life before. And it kept kind of rumbling. Like it was like mm -hmm, in my stomach. That scared the living shit out of me do you hear me first of all i ate the shit too fast that's number one too fast number two uh i shouldn't have ate it that late trying to go to sleep shouldn't have ate that and tried to go to sleep um and i definitely would have been throwing up acid i don't do that anymore <laughs> tell you that first of all i can't eat beef as fast and i got to have me something to let that shit digest because if it don't, that is absolutely the problem. When that, when that um beef or meat or whatever sit wherever up in here, it's the worst thing you could ever do to yourself. So my ass reflux has gotten way better. I still drink these because I don't I don't like it to be stuck. I, it got to go down. So um all the bullshit I used to eat, I don't eat it anymore. Uh, Sometimes I eat a lot. Sometimes I don't eat at all, to be honest with you, because I don't want to deal with whatever is coming my way. I don't want to deal with it. Um, so I just don't. Turkey wings are really good for me. And if y'all dealing with the same thing, tap into turkey wings. If you feel dizzy when you eat um, fried foods or um, fried foods or chicken, stop eating the shit. I don't eat fried foods like that anymore. I can't eat like chicken tenders. What is a chicken tender? What is a chicken wing? Um, fries is probably about the most fried anything that I eat. Um, yeah. That's why y'all see me have avocado toast this morning and shit like that. Um, I can't just bust down bacon and eggs. Remember my cholesterol was high. I don't eat eggs anymore. Just found out egg whites is made from eggs. Um, however, the egg whites, I will say, didn't make it don't make me feel the way eggs make me feel, but I'm still gonna stay away from those for real. So I can't really fuck with eggs. Um and I feel a lot better. I feel a whole lot better. So I just want to put that out there for any of y'all that's dealing with that and I don't take medication. I never wanted medication. And um definitely uh drink water now i'm trying my best to drink more water i am not the biggest water drinker at all but uh, i also went to tequila instead of drinking brown liquor and i know that when i when y'all see me drink it looks brown but it's like a liqueur with tequila but i stopped drinking brown liquor johnny walker 
burns. It, uh, any Anything brown burns real bad. So tequila does not. So I do not drink brown like that anymore. If I do it, I'll take a shot once a month. But I don't really do the brown anymore. Um, and also the liqueur I'm drinking helps with digestion. <laughs> so, I don't know. You just got to play Russian roulette with your body. Uh, take it very seriously because we are dying off um, earlier these days because the food and everything is just so bad. And when you got money, he got money. So he can order four burgers, two large fries, two large lemonades and be starving. It's almost like when you go to the grocery store, you go in there and you start eating a bag of chips. Then next thing you know, you taking down a Pepsi. Next thing you know, you ordering, you getting a whole bunch of groceries you wasn't even thinking about before you walked in the damn grocery store. But it's because you hungry. So he's like a kid in a candy store because he got money. You know what I'm saying? So he can hop on Uber and get whatever. You know what I'm saying? That's why he got four burgers. But I think he understand, hopefully now, that he may not need to do that. So men lose weight fast. He'll get that weight up off of him in a minute and, and be right back to eating them burgers. But y'all let me know what y'all think. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.